Dad, is someone out there watching us? Because I think the stars just blinked at me. Welcome back, time travelers and mystery seekers. This is the Enigma podcast, where science meets the unexplained, and every answer leads to more questions. Tonight's journey, a question whispered through centuries, what if time travel is already real? Joining me is our data-driven co-host, Nova, and we'll be visited by a very unusual guest. But first, my daughter Luna has something to say. Dad, if time travel is real, why haven't we seen proof? And what if someone did go back and change something? Wouldn't we notice? That's a great question, Luna. Maybe we have noticed, or maybe the chance was small enough to sleep through. Let's unpack the science. Let's break down the basics. Time travel is technically possible, at least forward in time. According to Einstein's theory of special relativity, time passes differently for objects in motion. The faster you move, the slower you experience time. This has been confirmed with satellites and atomic clocks. Right, an astronaut orbiting Earth for a year we age slightly less than someone on the ground. No sci-fi, that's science. Then there's gravitational time dilation. Time runs slower in stronger gravity. The closer you are to something massive, like a black hole, the more time stretches. So technically, we have already built time machines. They are just really slow. And that's just the beginning. Let's not forget the possibility of wormholes, bridges in space-time that could connect distant points, not only in space. Exotic matter is still theoretical, but so it was the black holes once. Exactly. Add quantum mechanics to the mix, and things get even weirder. Particles can exist in superposition, being in multiple places at once. And quantum tunneling might even allow them to leap between moments. If time is a fabric, these particles can poke holes in it. So, if quantum particles can break the rules of space and time, could a human ever ride that same wave? In theory, if you could survive the ride. You speak of bridges, but forget the rivers. Who is that? Everyone, meet Kronos, the timekeeper. Traveler. Nova, Luna, you examine time like a machine, but I have lived it, like a memory that never forgets. Kronos, we've talked about time as a dimension. Linear, cause and effect, but you say it's not a line? Time is not a thread, it is a spiral. Each revolution touches the last. To move forward is to echo the past, unless the spiral bends. Then, was a déjà vu? A glitchy memory or a wrinkle in time? A shadow of a step you already took. When time folds, some walk into moments twice. But if we're caught in that spiral, can we ever break free from it? Or are we stuck repeating our past? The spiral is not a prison. It is a reminder. Only those blind to their patterns repeat them. Are time travelers real? Some walk the spiral knowingly. Others stumble by accident and forget the way back. But the most dangerous are those who try to change what was. Let's talk paradox. The classic grandfather paradox. Go back and stop your grandfather from meeting your grandmother? You were never born? So, do you go back? This breaks logic. Unless we're in a multiverse. Each decision splits into a new timeline. The spiral allows for divergence. But beware. The further you stray, the louder the echo of your actions. 
Some echoes collapse timelines. So maybe time protects itself. It tries, but when too many tamper, the spiral tightens until it snaps. And then there's the role of quantum uncertainty. Reality isn't fixed, it's probabilistic. That alone introduces instability into the concept of time travel. You can't predict the outcome, not fully. Uncertainty is the guardian of time, and arrogance is its destroyer. All right, let's entertain it. What if time travel is already happening? There are stories, like the man who appeared in 1950s Times Square, wearing out-of-era clothes and vanished from the morgue or the chronovisor, a rumored Vatican device to view past events. Then there's a Montag project, time tunnels, secret experiments too wild to ignore. And even in real labs, like CERN, some researchers have proposed that miniature black holes or high-energy collisions might yield data relevant to space-time distortion. Wormhole simulations, laser-driven space manipulation, and quantum entanglement all signs that humanity is closer to time manipulation than we think. Some machines were almost built, some already were, and hidden. But the true travelers are the ones who watch. So you've seen them? The watchers? Yes, those who observe, who record, who warn. Like you. I do not warn, I remind. Before we close tonight's pyro, there's one more twist. What if the government already cracked the code? In 2023, a whistleblower named David Grouch, a decorated U.S. intelligence officer, claimed the government has recovered non-human craft. So real-time machines? Maybe gets deeper. These patents describe a craft using an inertial mass reduction device. In other words, a ship that warps the rules of motion and time. When gravity is tamed, time bows beside it. Then there's the TR-3B, a rumored black triangle craft, silent, fast, Define physics. Some say is man-made. Others reverse engineering from them. If all that's true, time travel isn't in the future. It's already part of the present. And hidden truths always echo louder than spoken ones. So what if time travel is real? Maybe it's not a matter of science, but awareness of our choices, our patterns, our memories. To understand time is not to escape it, but to walk with it. And maybe instead of chasing time, we should just listen to it. Because changing the past might break us, but learning from it, that's how we shape the future. And beware the ethics of the spiral. What you fix may break ten others. The more we pursue this mystery, the more we see how little we understand. The spiral continues. I leave you in this moment. Thank you for listening to the Enigma podcast. Was Kronos real or just a voice echoing from the edge of time? Don't forget to like, subscribe, and answer the question. What if you could time travel? Where or when would you go? Until next time, and remember, time waits for no one, but it remembers everything.